There you are. Welcome. Yes, Aloha. Aloha, everyone. Welcome to Emotion Radio Show. Awesome. Thank you for having me. Yes. Well, thank you. And I'm going to give you a little uh, context, guys. I met um, Michelle here with our dearest friends, Isla and Michelle. Welcome. Mahalo. Mahalo. Yeah. Um, so I started also Stand Together, Hawaii.com, mm. Stand Together. Yes, yes, I hear that show actually, and, you know, yeah. it was interesting. That's very, really, very really important you. because what they're doing now over in Maui with this bill, it's an SB 3381, uh, is really, really disturbing because they are wanting to, uh, they claim that they want to have, create this committee to rebuild Lahaina, but this bill is going to give complete control over the entire west coast of Maui to a committee of people that would be able to um, uh, acquire, remember one of the first words out of the governor's mouth after the fires was, yeah, I remember that interview, looking for the ways for state to acquire the land. They actually uh -huh. have created this committee that a lot of people need to, I'm um, sorry, this bill that is being rushed through legislation right now is going into the third um, uh, meeting. And we can look at the bill. I've actually created a whole document for people to review it. If you go to StandTogetherHawaii.com, click on Action, it's the very first thing that pops up. You'll see the bill. You'll see what, um, why we are. I'm so concerned about this bill. They, they actually have a part in there that says that they will comply with anything to get financial funding from, from the federal government. They um, have, have stated that they can take donations, gifts, um, money from any corporation, any uh, government agency. This, that actually opens the door to bribery and fraud, in my opinion. They uh, also state that they're going to be um, uh, assessing fees for landowners. This, this <laughs> assessing fees for landowners and if they're not allowed able to pay the fees, they are going to as assess interest and other fees that they don't even say what they are. And if they're not able to pay, then they'll be won't be able to um, have a lot of government um, uh, uh, structures that, that they would want, like um, if they need permits and, and things like that. That will will not uh, they won't be able to do have permits and different things like that. This this when was this last meeting? Today. I mean, today. <laughs> today. Yes. Okay. So okay. This is fresh. We can juicy. actually stop it. We can actually, what we're doing, standtogetherhawaii.com forward slash action will give you more information. But we're contacting the chair, is uh, Senator De La Cruz, and we're asking him, please do not put this on the next hearing. So we don't want this bill to be heard. We want it to die in the legislative process. And this is our power as people. Um, again, this bill is seven um, s b s is in sam b is in boy three three eight one s b three three eight one and we we want this to die because it, it will give oh and the other thing i want to share Wait, about is this it, what, what is the name again resolution no it's a it's a bill it's, it's a, a bill it's a bill, it's a bill. that's okay. being moved through okay. legislation really quickly the other thing that it says is that they're going to comply with their stakeholders one of the very first th uh, people that this bill is going to comply with it says it says stakeholders. Now I'm like, well, who are these stakeholders? That doesn't. The, the other place I found the word stakeholders was on. Um, I was re researching uh, 2011 to 2016. They wanted to. They uh, they have created a um, a committee for the smart city in Maui with Hawaiian and Japanese stakeholders. So if those are the same, those must be the same stakeholders they're talking about. Uh, this bill is very concerning. It should be concerning to all people on the islands. And okay, so, uh, well, it is very concerning, especially because there is so many pieces of this disaster that occur uh, in our neighbor island, right? That we love our Ohana, because the people have not even taken care of, right? That was a part of like I went with my other friend Michelle, another Michelle. I have, I have so many Michelles around me. I love it. Um, and, and that's the thing, right, guys? Like, we can take actions. Yes, we can. Uh, we feel empowered because they want to make us feel empowered. But there is actually, we are powerful. Yes. Together. Together. That's why it's stand. Stand. I love that. Like, so, girlfriend, like, yes, please watch. So, what are the next steps? Like, how can we help? Like, you know, 
The next step is to go to standtogetherhawaii.com, click on uh, join, uh, join our email list because I always send out emails of actions that we can take together and we are way more powerful. So we are sending um, an affidavit of truth uh, to the governor uh, in regards to all of the things because in my opinion that I feel Maui was attacked. And I have right, a lot of, right, of right. research based on that. And also, um, if we want to, so I am that pacifier, right, that I do understand that things, everybody can have their own reality. Everything is true, right? In their own minds, in their own self, in their own bodies, whatever, right? Um, we cannot feed uh, ego with ego or anger with anger. So it is like to send love to the people that maybe perhaps they don't know. That's what I, I like to think, right? Oh, they don't know what they're doing, right? It's like, okay, they think they're doing good, but they're doing wrong to our own people, right? So, uh, and is there going to be like to, to take down that bill? Can we call the, you know, like yes. how, how we do it? What we can Hawaii? do is we can contact, and the information is again, it's on standtogetherhawaii.com forward slash action. We contact um, Senator De La Cruz. It's in his pocket. It's, in, it's on his desk. So we tell him, please do not move this forward. Do not put this on the agenda for the hearing for the, for the next meeting. We, we don't want him to do that because if he doesn't do that, this bill will die. And we want this bill to die because, again, this is Bill SB 3381. It gives, it gives complete control over the entire West Maui coast Okay, and um, how can we make uh, this be heard as well with the people in Maui? Have you contacted the leaders of the movement? Because I have a few ones as well. Maybe, oh, that's great. Right after here, we can uh, start sending all this information out. Yes. Because, and, and you guys, you know, this is the power of the, the people, right? And the word of mouth. If you have friends in Maui, if you know anybody in Maui, you know, of a friend of a friend that is from Maui but lives here, but you have a, oh, you have family in Maui, start asking, right? Yeah. And share, go to, again, where is the Stand, StandTogetherHawaii.com, click on action, and it's the very first action. Yeah, the very it, it literally it says, here's the bill, if you want to read it for yourself. Then there's a, the second button is I break the whole bill down by not only pages but lines. It says okay. page. All the information about the bill, everything. as B as a boy, 3381 is it stand, stand together, together Hawaii.com. Hawaii. Hawaii. Click on action. As well, uh, do you have a social media? Yes. The, actually, if you go to Stand Together Hawaii, you can click on the YouTube channel. The YouTube channel is, is, uh, is my regular business, which is Blossom Inner Wellness. And I have a ton of videos on this. I just did two. Um, the third one is going to be up tomorrow about this bill. And um, a lot, a lot of information on uh, the night fires. OK, guys. Well, this is, this is big, right? So if you want to do something, remember it's always from the place of love, from the heart. And because, you know, there is justice and there is peace. And we, we can carry that with us and we can do our little or big to share it with others, right? Yes. Remember, we're higher than this. This is just the playground. We're just playing a game, the game of life. So remember not to take things personal. It, it's hard, especially when we've been on the pressure for years, generations, uh, you know, thousands of years. But, oh, and, and I have questions. I have questions now, right? Because in their last blog, in our last blog, we were just talking about uh, Maui, the Maui fires, and that there was a bill that needs to be stopped. Stopped. Thank you very much, S. B as a boy, 33A1. Thank you for sharing all this information. So we need to, be, we need to go to StandTogetherHawaii.com, StandTogetherHawaii.com forward slash action. You'll see the bill. You'll see um, who to contact. Right now it says it's, it's in Senator Dela Cruz's office, and we are asking him, do not move this forward. Do not put this on the agenda for the next meeting. And if he does not do that, this bill will die. This bill is, um, it, it, it creates, it's called the Lele uh, Community District. And the Lele community, they say in the proposition, uh, I'm sorry, the proposal that it's for rebuilding of Lahaina, this bill will give complete control and power of the entire west coast of Maui, not just Lahaina, the entire west coast of Maui, in the hands of nine people. 
to be able to get funding from the federal government. Hands of nine people. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Wait. Over, over. First, it was only hundreds, uh, the K or the, the desaparecidos, and now uh, we know we've got a big fat like. Anyway, uh, I don't want to get too into it. Yes, yes, guys, let's take action. Yes, yes. there is ways, but I mean, and how? How a wahine, well, I get it, right? It's a wellness, your, your blossom, right? Like the, the wellness page, the YouTube channel. The YouTube channel is Blossom Inner Wellness. If blossom you go to Stand Inner Together, she got amazing information. I've seen multiple, guys. So, yeah. uh, but if you were, you wrote a book and died in hell. So you mean, okay, I'm a biohacker, right? I, I studied human body, I, I understand da, 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 how we work. I, I love fasting, I've done love, tried and done a lot of techniques. Uh, how do you end up then coming into the uh, the other like you know the politics the life you know community which I love it right it's like let's stand together because yeah. that's me too right yeah. but I just want to hear you. yeah well what happened was I've been a fitness and wellness instructor for 30 years and then uh, moved here my family's been on island for 25 years moved here 2019 a lot of things were happening that I did not agree with. And my passion is people. I love people, and, I, and I, I've always stuck up for the underdog. And when this um, started happening, I started speaking out. But then when the fires happened, and I, <laughs> I started... Just a year ago. Yeah, okay, August. In August, um, that, was, that was also a big blow. I, I've interviewed a f almost 50-year arborist who yes, has, has, I've seen, that. has That's seen it. It's almost half a million views on that. explains like um, the different... I love when science comes a flow, right? And there's like, okay, well, science is proven, right? Like how the molecules, how we are, we are a beautiful, the most advanced mechanism, you know, tool that we have is our body, yes, right? And we're a beautiful experiment, and the experiment is our own self. But because we're that smart, right? Look at where we come from. Look mm -hmm. at the things we have created as humanity. I am as well like that. I'm passionate, I'm in pro of, let's forgive our own selves, right, like our for humanity, whatever, the bad guy, well, okay, the bad guy has his reasons for being the bad guy, and without the dark, there is no light, or, you know, I'm grateful for darkness, because then we can even be brighter, okay, in, in that sense, but it's hard yes. to be always like, well, I love what you, you know, said earlier. Finger. You said this is a game, and I completely agree. Every single time I, I do a YouTube, I always do a prayer at the end, and I remind people this is a game for our soul because this body will stay here on earth, but our soul expands. Yes. And how we be in this world, the spirit expands through the drama and trauma that we've experienced. And it's that's either, either how it we carry that through generations, right? Correct. That's what we're doing. So Correct. I love it. I love uh, all these things. So. I, and I feel that they, they must be, unfortunately, events like the Maui or what Palestine, you know, all the things that are happening in the world for the eyes and the cellular awakening, yes. right? That we need to be like, wait, why? Okay, okay, for, there it comes the, the madness, right? Like, it's like, this is not fair. You know, I, I was one of the ones like you. There was a group, I, my other friend, Michelle, we just, it was like the first week I mean, we follow how the fire happened that day. We knew, and not only that fire. Guys, I just want to bring some awareness about what's happening here in the fires. I just feel it's not fair again, right? Uh, the our whole Kohala uh, Ranch fires, right? And the Hapuna, uh, well, Mauna Kea, next to Mauna Kea. Uh, all those fires, they've been for a couple of years already, the permits and process for the land to, to be developed, guys, okay? Mm -hmm. This is, uh, all the realtors know, you know, and it's easy to get all this information because this beautiful Wahine Beth Thomas, you know, she makes a lot of articles. So I, I came across one that she wrote two years ago about that land. And then next thing we know, there is these fires. And next thing we know, now there's roads that are, building the fire sections versus wait what's going on right so why why to lie to us to the people right yeah. when we know housing is a big issue in our area and we're trying to help our families to stay here because it's a local that being carrying the inheritance right of the land we care for the land but then all of a sudden, developers come, 
And I just feel like that's not fair. We need to call the things how to call it. Yes, crime. Absolutely. It needs to be called crime. And when somebody commits, like I don't know who is in charge of uh, giving those permits, but there were fires and things. Who pays for all that? Is it our taxes? We pay for the firefighters, you know, their lives. You know, I care for all those guys. Yeah. Why? Right? Yeah, well, it's control. It's absolute control because I said earlier that uh, the 2020, 2011 to 2016, there was a smart city community created by Hawaiian and Japanese stakeholders to make Maui the first smart city. This is why this bill is moving so forward so fast and it, it, it will encompass the entire west coast of Maui. It's not just Lahaina and, and the wording in there is really, really scary. They're, they said they will comply with anything the federal government uh, uh, wants basically to get financial funding from the federal government. They're gonna, they literally say they'll comply with anything. Lots of wording in there that's really scary that would allow for bribes, that will allow for fraud. So it, it seems to me uh, not even a year from when it happened, everything was very well planned. It's been a long, yeah, it's With been in the works. Beautiful steps, you know, and, and now our poor people that suffer a terrific disaster event. Okay, let's honor, right? Let's just honor, let's do the right thing. So how can we do the right things? step up, yep. right? If yep. you feel you, you resonate with this, right? And you are a mover and shaker, and it's the year of the dragon, and you're like, okay, I've been before saying, maybe we can't, maybe we can. We can, you guys. Okay. We really, really can. There's, If we each stepped up and, and, and contacted Senator De La Cruz, told him not to move forward, SB 3381, you can find that information of how to do that at standtogetherhawaii.com forward slash action. It's all right there, and I give every single action I do, we can easily take, but we are way more powerful when we do this together. And I feel it's the time, mm -hmm. you know, it's the time that, hey guys, uh, whoever is not doing the right things, maybe because they don't know, let's help them to do the right things. I'm, I'm a passionate, I, I love to collaborate with a county and uh, here in Kohala, we're very, very honored to have very wise people that they're always movers and shakers right here. Um, and healers, and uh, especially retires, I love you guys. Uh, because, you know, they know. So they're there in the committee of, of everything, and all the departments, all doing things, and we repair things before even the state or the county or whoever can even come. And that's how what happened in Maui, mm -hmm. right? Yes, absolutely. And, and they need us again. They need us again, and also um, we need to understand that this, this time is the time of awakening, and it, it really means, are you going to say, I'm too busy? Because if you say that, yeah, you're yeah. taking freedom it's away from your keiki, and, and the keiki are not going to be the ones to step up. It's, it's us, and it has to be now. <laughs> it's the moment to, uh, to unite. Yes, right. absolutely. And remember, always from the, from the heart. From oh, the, that's the exactly right. The place of love. And because we tend to do that, right? Like then we ca get caught up in the game. Yeah. Uh, we get caught up in like, ah, but why is it? Like, you know, I really could be very frustrated. I used to be very, very, um, I couldn't control my emotions and I was very frustrated, you know, and just anger management and all these things. That's why now I, I'm, I'm the opposite, right? I learn what it brought me through my life. And I totally understand that in the moment it's hard to manage your emotions and your feelings, but you need to stop because in the next, you know, next page of the book, it's gonna be way more beautiful and yes. easier. Yes, yes, yes. You know, so it's worth it to just like be okay. I'm gonna hold it. I know this is not right, but hey, let's do these things. This is, and that's the thing. It's like. I know this is not right, so I'm going to just take one action, and I'm going to trust in a higher power yes. that it's going to work, and that things are happening that I can't see because that are going to make are. the world a better place. And those who are in power, who are not for the Aina and not for Aloha or the Ohana, they are going to be peaceably removed, or they're going to voluntarily remove. Yeah, and I just yeah. trust in that higher power, taking that one action, and, and that's all it takes. And it is, it is true. It is true that's that's happening. You know, it is. True, we're we're doing the job with Mother Earth because actually I I'm sure you know as well about it, right? Like uh, the whole shift of the of the poles. Yes, I heard. Yes, right? and this is just recent, like mm -hmm. this week. 
you know, from the 19th of February. All the planets alignment, all the, everything is so, you know, what's happening here in the third dimension, what's happening in the cosmos, in the universe, it's just a reflection. We're aligned. And we have the power of decision. Yes, we do. And we the do. power of choice. And yes. that's why we need to choose love. And it's so exciting Among to be alive right now because yes. we, we get to be the ones that watch as harmony and peace and love come, come back to the earth, to the world. And we were part of it. We, we took a stand and we were part of that change. It's about time. So, you know, I want to invite you guys. We're going to have a couple songs right here coming up. And then we're going to come back. And we're talking something about healing trauma, right? Yeah, yeah. And I just feel that realistically <clears throat> trauma is in our cellular constitution right and all type of trauma yes. um, but especially from like not feeling that we belong in certain areas right or because of the our indigenous roots and all these things and then overtaking power right I watch other video very good that I love where um, it explained all the constitution, like how actually it was that agreement when the United States, uh, you know, the deep, getting deep into that information, like, oh, there's actually less things that they should be doing and more things that Hawaii can still do. But I think the knowledge is the little part that is missing there. But anyway, how can we heal trauma over generations? Yes, well, first you have to understand that Trauma is in every cell, like you said earlier, it's every cell of the body, and the body actually becomes conditioned to the trauma. So the sphere that, that has been pushed on us for many, many years now, people wake up and they're afraid, and they go out, they don't trust. And that, that frequency, that feeling, is actually an emotional conditioned pattern in your body that you keep living with every single day, and you don't even realize it. So the first thing that you do, and the first thing that I do, when I start to feel anxiety or fear or anger, is I actually put my hand on my heart and I connect first with my heart and then I breathe deeply because when you are stressed out and when you're in fear, you're shallow breathing, you're not breathing deeply. Mm -hmm. And then I tell myself, Michelle, this is a normal human feeling. There's nothing wrong with this feeling. This is nothing good or bad. It's just a frequency. And I let myself feel the feeling completely as I breathe fully into my body. And when, that, when I do that, the feeling starts to dissolve. And it's just a, an easy practice that anybody can do at any time, driving a car, standing in line. And because we all have it, the same time. Yeah, no, and actually, you know, I, I just find myself, um, well, when I say that, I refer as well, I go all the way to childhood, right? Because exactly. let's understand where we come from. Yeah. Uh, we were babies, right? We come from a belly. We come into the earth. We know we're coming, but it's like, okay, we don't know nothing. We forget everything. It's like we're brand new, empty, empty, full empty lienzo para pintar, Picasso, right? Okay. And for me, is my understanding like how, like, okay, well, how can I just point at fingers at people that, oh, oh, they're bad people? No, we all are experiencing different games in the same game, right? Different right. characters. Yeah. And what if I have come and experienced all the other ones, and the only one left to experience is that route? <laughs> right? Okay, let me take that right, <laughs> the right of the game. And is that, uh, well, okay, I came to experience it, didn't last long or whatever. Let me take it again. Yep, that's, <laughs> that's exactly. how I feel the game of life is. Yeah. But I love what you're saying, like putting your heart. So how can we teach our children, right? Like, I'm sorry, I'm going back to root the rep. Yeah. So the babies, right? Like, imagine, I, I feel it's important since babies, right? When you're leaving your kids to uh, kindergarten, to schools, where, where now these days is a modern lifestyle. <clears throat> And we leave them there, and he's like, oh, okay, baby, put your hand in your heart, remember, I'm always here, you know, this is me, this is mom, but not only me, mom, mom the earth, mom the cosmo, mom that, you know, just that protection. Well, what actually what that they can do as well is they can totally validate your children's feelings. Like, don't, like, don't ignore them. That's right. because when you validate right. and you say, hey, I know you're scared right now. It's okay. This feeling you're feeling right now, it's okay that you're feeling this. And it, when you validate that, that will actually help them feel safe. Yeah, and mm -hmm. invite them to talk about it. Because I, I come from different generations yeah. that were, they used to tell, don't, don't talk about your feelings. Yeah. No, I'm scared. Don't be scared. That was it. <laughs> I'm sad. Don't be sad. <laughs> okay. How can you, you know? Um, but yes, it's, it's important to teach our new generations 
to open up yes. and heal our traumas. And what did really, really didn't work on us, let's change it, let's expand, let's don't take the same channels, that, you know, same routes that are going to take us to disaster. Yeah, and I want to invite people too to do that with yourself as far as validate your feelings. Because you, we, we yeah. go so fast and we forget, we, we don't, don't forget, we're like, I don't have time, I don't have time to cry, I don't have time, you know, to, for this and that. But when you're feeling, it could take 10 seconds and you go, okay, I'm afraid right now, or I'm sad. It's okay that I'm feeling this way. And you breathe into it, that's going to change it. You feel to be active, right? Nature, always nature is the key. Feel connected to the, the moon, the stars at night, daytime, uh, go active, right? your fitness, CrossFit, yeah. what, what, what do you do? What? Oh, I teach a Pilates uh, endurance toning um, fascia release class. And it's, uh, you can learn more about that at Blossom Inner Wellness. Would you like, maybe we can do a workshop on my space. No, that'd be fun. I can host up to 12 people on the floor, mm -hmm. like the good space. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that'd be great. I love it. I love, that's one thing I do every Tuesday morning at 7 a.m. so people can join as well. There you go. That's beautiful. Yeah, because the fascia is so important. We mm -hmm. need to open up all the fascia because it's very I just love the human body, how every thought, you know, is just pure energy. And then there is the, the path that goes through, all, the route that takes through our body. You know, I, I totally would love to, for all humanity to understand the power of your body, you know, and see it more of like, oh, wow, like the most, what iPhone 25, what, you know, like, no, no. Mm -hmm. a porch, you know, like Ferrari, tell me the, the best brand of whatever, no. Your body, yeah, it's even more it's amazing. Incredible. Get passionate, and guess what? You carry one. You don't need to earn tons of, of dollars for to buy one. You already carry you, one. It's yours forever <laughs> for for, the, for your life for your entire life. This is but yours. You better get yeah. to know yourself. Exactly. When is your body telling you with sickness? Sickness is a communication that I will share. Yeah, and one thing I would actually highly recommend that everybody get is activated charcoal. Oh, I love activated, activated charcoal. <laughs> Anytime I get sick, I, I take activated yes. charcoal like once an hour and uh, quercetin with zinc yeah. because yeah, that yeah, yeah. really helps to boost magnesium. the immune system. Magnesium. 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 Yeah. 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 yeah, but I was I was aching one day all over and I started Bad activated tinge. charcoal and quercetin. The next day, just small headache, the, the next day, done. No, no, I love it. Ha uh, and another hack for activated charcoal to use, if you, you know, like um, alcohol here and there, you get that, you, you drink, and then before going to sleep or something, you, you drink your activated charcoal, and that actually absorbs all the toxins. Or if, you know, you, you don't, you eat healthy, but sometimes you want to, don't, you know, whatever, piece of cake, then, it's okay. <laughs> uh, then you can do activated charcoal, yeah. absorbs all the toxins, and then guess what? Well, at least you're you know, helping, yeah. helping yourself. Yes. Help yourself. Hey, Michelle, well, it's been a pleasure. It's 157 on this beautiful February 21st. Anything else that you want to add to the audience? In yeah, Kampala? have faith. Uh, join StandTogetherHawaii.com. Join the email list. Get emails from me about things that are coming down the pipeway that every single person on the islands should know about. Uh, what is this bill, SB 3381, really, we, we can stop it, you guys. We, we, we can do it. we got to do it together. So standtogetherhawaii.com.